The man, the myth, the rebel. Saw Guerrero. Hello Star Wars fans, my name is Joel Robinson and this is the 16 day video countdown to Rogue One. Today I'm going to be speculating on the future fate of Rogue One fan favorite character Saw Guerrero. After his three episode arc in season 5 of the Clone Wars, Saw quickly became a character fans began to like, and a character many fans would like to see to return in some form. Well fans, prayers were answered in June 2016, as Saw made history as the first animated Star Wars character to come to the big screen. Now in Rogue One, we see a very different Saw than we saw in the Clone Wars. He's much older, and with that age comes experience. He witnessed and fought alongside the Rebellion during the rise of the Empire. This leaves the question, what will Saw be doing during Rogue One? Saw, at the time we meet him in Rogue One, is the leader of a rebel cell on Jeddah. He is recruited by Jen to help the Alliance to restore the Republic. He is one of the major unifiers of the Rogue One team, pushing them not only to seek the destruction of the Death Star, but believe in the dream of the Republic. So what if Saw is one of the main reasons our heroes are able to gain the plans to the Death Star? I would speculate that Saw decides to join our rebels, and probably gives himself up in order to help them succeed. This also raises the question, how will Saw die? Although it is still uncertain, I believe that Saw will die on Jeddah as the Empire tests its super laser on the moon. If that seems a little bit soon, then I beg to remind you that Obi-Wan Kenobi, a major hero, died only 93 minutes into the first movie and was dead as a Force ghost for the rest of the series. Saw's death would be a heart aching loss, and it may make fans question, why would they do that? I'd say it is because of that heartache that they would kill him off, because he's such an influential and impactful and emotional character to our story. By killing Saw, his death will have a huge emotional impact for Clone Wars fans, as well as the character of Jin. Jin had known Saw for years before meeting him again in Rogue One. For her, he is as close as family. Plus, the audience will need a reason to care about the Moon of Jeddah. If all of our major characters survive, why would we care that the entire moon is destroyed? If the thought of him dying is too much to bear, there is another option. Saw, as a character, has the skills and military know-how to build the Rebel Alliance into an actual army. In fact, what if Saw became a general for the Rebel Alliance in their ground battles? Is it likely? No. But it does feel better than the thought of him dying. What do you think? Will Saw live, or will he sacrifice himself for the greater good? We all will know for sure in just five days. A special thank you to Rogue Squadcast co-host Eric Patrick Cameron for writing this episode for me. Be sure to tune in to the next episode of the Rogue Squadcast as we break down all the happenings from Rogue One. And as always, may the Force be with you.